Shay, did you see the uh, Luis Clases upset of Victor Ortiz? Yeah, I did. What did yeah. you think of that? Well, I picked him to win. Uh, Luis is a, a tough fighter, man. So uh, I had a chance to make, mix him like uh, mix it up with him in the amateurs, and he's a, he's a he's a great fighter. I knew uh, it was going to be tough for Victor Ortiz, especially coming off that layoff. But uh, even without the layoff, I knew it was a tough fight for him anyway. Well, do you think Ortiz is a mental thing? Is his head not in the game, or is it his chin? What What do you feel? I just don't think he falls a better fighter. Um, that's that that's the bottom line. I think whenever you uh, you, you get knocked out, you want to kind of uh, evaluate your career and where you're at. Because at the end of the day, uh, it's boxing, you know. So you don't want to uh, be hurt, get hurt or nothing like that. But uh, I don't know. Maybe he got a little left. But uh, I just think uh, uh, Colazzo was a better fighter, man. What's a good fight for Colazzo? I would like to see him against uh, Keith Thurman. Maybe Sean Porter. Okay. Um, there's some fights out there for him, for him in a, a talent and rich uh, uh, welterweight division. Uh, you have uh, Madonna, uh, Madonna, Adrian Broner. So this is man, that, that division is stacked. So there's some good fights out there for him. I would love to see him cash in, like I said, against a uh, Keith Thurman or maybe even the Sean Porter. Could he beat man. those guys though? I think he can uh, beat anyone. Uh, you know, I think he proved that with uh, Victor Ortiz and uh, obviously. Uh, He's a great fighter, so I, I, I think he stands a chance against any of those guys.